Well, you are watching our HSN Cooks event. This is this is an event that we love so much to bring to you because we get a chance to bring you the best of the best in the industry. So whether you have been cooking for years or you're saying, I don't even know where to start, you are gonna find what you need in this entire day and particularly in the next couple of hours with me. So I hope that you'll hang in there. I'm Tamara Hooks and I'm gonna be cooking and eating right along with you. And we are gonna get it started with something that we are so glad to bring new to you from Chef Rick Bayless. And what you're seeing right here is the enamel on steel 12 quart tamale steamer and stock pot. This is by far the largest that we have ever offered, that you've ever been able to have a chance to get. And whether it is when you are cooking that authentic Mexican food or any kind of food that you like to eat, go ahead and uh, pick this up. Now, you've got to meet our guest for this um, for the beginning of this hour, Chef Rick Bayless. He is a chef, he's a restaurateur, an author, a TV personality. He is a... Uh, yeah, philanthropist, award-winning, and we are so glad to have are you. Are you kidding? I am so happy to be <laughs> here. Thank you so much. Definitely, because for so many years, I mean, you've been bringing literally, um, you specialize in authentic Mexican I cuisine. I do. I lived in Mexico for years and years, and then I brought all of that culture back. Okay, so we get a chance to benefit from it. Yes, yes. and that's what we're doing here today. That's what we're going to do. And you, okay, so you didn't start small. No. <laughs> Actually, this is one of my favorite pots, and I think every single kitchen needs one. Yeah. So this is like a stock pot, mm -hmm. but you can use it for a tamal steamer. Mm -hmm. um, you could use it to make a big batch of chili. Mm -hmm. To tell you the truth, I even use it as a big mixing bowl. When oh, I'm going to have a whole bunch of people over, what I will often do is to mix my salads in it yeah. and then put that into serving dishes to pass around. Every That's kitchen hot. needs something like that. And this is the thing. You have now a piece of cookware that, of course, 12 quarts, so it's, it can hold everything. And you can cook on it on any kind kind yes. of heating surface that you like to cook on. So there is no limit. If you, no matter how you like to cook, you can do it here with this steamer stock pot. So where should we start Okay, here? we've got to start with the really traditional thing because I think that every house yeah. needs to have a, a steamer for tamales. Yeah. Okay, the reason I say that is that tamales always mean fiesta. They always mean that you're having a party yeah. and it, just look in this thing. Oh my gosh. Okay, so there's a couple of dozen tamales oh, down wow. in here. I'm gonna pull one of them out here so that it's you can right. taste it because I have to say, this experience, do you smell that? That is amazing. It's, when you make tamales, the whole house smells of tamales and That's everybody right. gets super excited. That's right. Now, and I'm you gonna, know, like you said, nobody makes just one or no, just six. No, 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 no. <laughs> you got to do a lot of them here. And I'm going to put a little bit of salsa on this one. Okay. I think I picked up a very large spoon there. Okay. But I'm going to hand you this because I want to know what you think of this beautiful tamale that, that smells so much. Now, mm. I've got a little bit of green chili chicken filling in there Ooh, this and is to me so good. that's what that's what really makes this so special this is the kind of tamal mm. that you will find people uh, eating all over central oh. mexico it's the, it's the real deal, right? This is so okay. good. So you have to have a steamer to That's be able right. to make these. As with. I was going to say, so, it's not dried out no, in no, no, way. No, 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 no. It has, it has a rack in the bottom, mm -hmm. and you put the uh, the water in the bottom of it, and then you put your tamales standing up in there, and then they're ready for your, your fiesta. Mm. You can take this pot mm -hmm. straight to your buffet table and serve right out of it because it's a really beautiful piece. It really is. And this is something, again, that we don't typically see when it comes no, to no. a pot in this size, in this yes, way. Yes, exactly. Okay, so now this is steel that is covered with enamel, mm -hmm. which means that it's super easy to clean. Mm -hmm. It's very resistant to any kind of sticking or burning or anything, and it's got this beautiful stainless steel exterior here, which I think means that you're gonna, it's gonna look beautiful forever. It's not gonna chip around the outside. This is so perfect. Okay. It's so, so perfect, yeah. That's not the only thing that you can do with this, is to make these tamales. Okay, okay. tell but, me. Um, okay, so we're gonna go next here. Oh, wow. Okay, so there's 32 pieces <laughs> of corn. Oh <laughs> 30, 32, 32 pieces. 32 ears of yes, corn. Uh, yes, exactly. That's what we've got here. Oh, now, my god. In, in Mexican tradition, okay, so you're going to have the whole neighborhood <laughs> over. That's right. And you put that little rack in the bottom of it, put your, yeah. your um, water in there, mm -hmm. and you can steam so much of it. Again, beautiful. You could just put it right on the buffet table. But this is what they do in Mexico. Mm -hmm. 
They take the uh, the corn and they slather it uh -oh. with oh, this, is where this it gets beautiful great. mayo. Mm. I, sometimes I like to mix sour cream and mayo together. Oh, wow. But you just put that on the top of it. And this, oh man, this is so delicious. Slather that on like that. Okay. Now some people might think that that looks a little odd, but wait till you taste it. Oh, it's wait. unbelievable. This that. is Mexican queso fresco. Oh wow. You could use goat cheese crumbles, feta cheese oh. crumbles. You put a little bit of uh, spice on oh, the top of, course, of that. Oh, of course. You've got to have spice in your oh, life. Oh, yeah, you yeah, have yeah. to. I'm going to take a few of the cilantro leaves oh, and wow. sprinkle those over the top of it. And just look at that. The guests are just oh. going to go crazy for that. I'm sure of that one. And, okay. and, and remember, this was 32 ears 32 of corn. 32 ears of corn. That, I'm going to slide this one right over here. It's huge. Okay. And that's what we're talking about. These are, right. these, we're just giving you ideas of what you're going to be able to do with this. You know, and of course, use your own imagination. Absolutely. If, you, if you're cooking for an army, if you're cooking for just six hungry people, it doesn't matter. <laughs> this is the way that you do it. So yeah. there is no, you know, there's no rule. There's no one way. Just to let you know that we only have a couple hundred of these, okay? So I know you want to continue to watch Chef Rick Bayless, but while you're watching, please go ahead and call or you can go to hsn.com to order. Okay, so we've got another use uh -oh. for this oh, beautiful, wow. beautiful pot. Yeah, and, and notice that you're, you're, you did this with a gas burner. I did it with a gas burner because okay. that's another piece of equipment that I really like in my house because when I'm having a whole crowd over, mm -hmm. I like to put the pot like that and put it out on the buffet and let people help themselves nice. to a really beautiful chili. Ooh, okay, so this. we've got this big pot of chili simmering away. Oh, and wow. You could make soup in this. I, in fact, I make uh, all kinds of stocks and soups in it all the time. I'm going to put a little bit of cheese over the top of it. Okay, look at that. Okay, a spoonful of sour cream. Oh. Oh, wow. A few of these gorgeous green onions over the top of that. And just look at that. It's so beautiful, but it's just beautiful like that pot it's, is beautiful. It's the most perfect. And do you see there is so much chili in here and there's room <laughs> for more. Yes, like, there is room for more. Literally, he only did about two thirds of the pot. You can feed the entire football team, the entire soccer team, the entire basketball team. I'm telling you. And that's why every household needs one of these pots. Th and that's very true. And I'll tell you, for this event, for the cooks event, and I'm going to show you this right here because it's too pretty to, to keep to myself. Take a look at that. Um, for this event, we did take $10 off of our regular HSN price on this one. We do have free shipping on that, and that's a big deal, too, because not only is it sizable, you have something that has a great weight to it. And so, and, and of course, when it comes to cooking, you need both, and you want both. Do you do. Yes, for sure. But what there's do, more. Oh, here. my gosh. There's more. What's, what's <laughs> behind wait, lid number okay. four? <laughs> so look at this. This is like that classic oh, seafood wow. boil. We have potatoes oh and mussels and crab, some sausages oh. in here, some <laughs> shrimp in here. We've got a lobster. Wow. I mean, just look at this beautiful thing. So if you get in the mood for that classic New England uh, seafood yeah. boil, this is the kind of plot, pot that is going to allow you to be able to cook it in high style. Look at, oh uh, my gosh. Okay. And it's, it keeps there, going more. and going and going. I could go on and on and on because there are like, there's like like triple this right. amount in that pot. When you think about this, so so whether it is tamales, which is where we started, right. we had the 32 ears of corn, corn, we had the chili, we've got the seafood boil, right. literally you've covered the gamut and then some. <laughs> yeah, and I know as you're watching, I know you're thinking, oh gosh, if only I had it right now. Call us, like I said, or go to hsn.com and make sure you get it because it it is singly, I think, one of the most versatile pieces that you're going to be able to use in your kitchen and you're going to pull you're not even going to pull it out time and time again you're going to leave it out because I think when you see it, when you see what you can do with it and see how much it holds, it's going to be the one pot that you want to use all the time. Absolutely. And you're really going to want it how, when you, people are coming over for dinner. You want to put that out with some beautiful soup in it. Yeah. It's it's just the absolute best way to serve a crowd. It absolutely is. I love this enamel coating. It's like glass. And it's such a pretty color. It really <laughs> is. Um, easy to use, easy to clean. Right. You do have a manufacturer's lifetime limited warranty 
on this yep. one. And uh, and we would love for you to own this one. Oh, it looks like we've got a special guest. Oh, oh wow. Nice. Oh, Shirley, please show yes. oh. <laughs> well, I'm watching this on there. I'm, I'm back you, there. I'm glad you brought it. your own. I was going to eat, a, I was, I was gonna I eat some snack. Oh, Why am I eating yeah, a snack okay. when you have the best chef Rick Bayless? Hi, honey. How are you? Good to see you. I These know. are nice. Look, aren't they gorgeous? They're huge. Like oh. I told you, though, I'm going to make it square next time. <laughs> yes, you are. <laughs> it's easy. Just run over it. That's all you have to do. I mean, how good okay. is this food, right? Okay. Oh, it's amazing. Rick's one of the best. Best. Tamales There's are for real. Chili for Ming Tsai. Yes. I love it. Thank you for dropping by. Oh, you're so great. Oh, no. Take part amazing. in all of this. Amazing. Thank you for doing our class. <laughs> yes. I'll try. Just, just so Appreciate you know, fewer than 200 of these left, and then that's it. Then we say goodbye to this one until we can bring more in, okay? So stay on the line for this one. We'd love for you to have it. You can get it home on any major credit card for about just under $20 to get that home. Now, uh, Chef Rick Bayless also has the five and a half quart ceramic casserole as well. And so if that's one that you had your eye on, maybe you saw that one a little bit earlier in some of our, um, in some of our presentations, you can go ahead and pick that up as well. And now you see how you're starting to build or maybe rebuild your cookware collection that you've got at home. So enjoy that one as well. Take advantage of all of our Cooks event pricing um, too. All right, and I also wanted to show this to you. This is your four quart ceramic bean and stew pot first off I love the shape on that it's so, it's so interesting it and unique it really is and that's a really classic shape that's been made in Mexico for centuries and centuries for sure So you're also sort of communing with the past I think when you see something like that I think so okay all right so we do move on yes. and um, this is our 24-hour cooks event just so you know and we're just getting started yes I have to share with you what I think is so amazing. You are looking at every single one, handcrafted, hand created, handmade, hand chiseled, hand chiseled in by fact. artisans in Mexico. Every single one is going to be unique. And what you're seeing is the mortar and pestle. Now, if you've been to some of those high end Mexican restaurants, you've seen that they have come to your table and made guacamole at your table in pieces like these. You get a chance to have them at home. Yes, and this is a piece that is made out of really dense lava rock. It's called basalt, and this is the classic, classic way to make a mortar and pestle in Mexico. The name for it is molcajete there, and these are made by traditional artisans in Mexico. Every one of them will be slightly different. You can see slightly different heights in these, and the exterior decoration that's on them is slightly different as well. Mm -hmm. And it's the perfect thing to make salsa in. So what I'm doing here is to crush the tomatillos, the little green tomato looking things, um, and I'm crushing them with some garlic and some green chili. And you just crush against the, the, the pestle, against the base of the mortar. And what you get is a flavor that is unlike any other flavor that you will ever taste in your whole life. Mm -hmm. Because when you crush the ingredients together, you get such amazing flavors that you will never get by chopping them up. So you could even call this thing the, like the original food processor oh, wow. yeah. <laughs> because this is what was used before. Now I'm going to grab a little bit of cilantro and okay. put it in there because that's where you really notice the difference when you crush the cilantro in. Mm -hmm. So I'm just putting it on the side here and crushing it into the salsa. And then I'm going to make this into a, a green salsa verde that has got a little bit of avocado in it. Okay. So I'm going to open an avocado up here. All right. And then I'm going to show you a little trick that I like to use all the time, and that is to dice the avocado right in the skin, mm -hmm. like that. Mm -hmm. So one way, then the other. We're learning. And then I'm going to scoop out the avocado into the salsa. Gosh. Like that, and, and that everything's was perfect, perfect I mean, this diced. Is for them too. <laughs> yes, exactly. Yeah. So it's a really easy thing to do. We got to get that pit out of there, okay. and it doesn't want to come out the same way that I thought it should come out. So okay. I'm going to pull it out uh, right. there. And just so you know, I mean, I, I was telling uh, Chef a little bit earlier before the show that I, I think avocado. I personally think avocados make everything better. I would agree with that. Definitely. That's very true. And if you love them, if you love them for you know, for your, for your salsas, for your dips, for, you know, in, in, in any and every kind of way, then this 
is the only way to have them in the most authentic way when you consider every single one of these mortar and pestles are hand handmade. Okay. Made. So now we are going to have some friends over and you want to just put out some chips and salsa. Could you imagine when you put it out oh in this beautiful molcajete, this beautiful mortar and pestle? Um, it oh will just make wow. everybody's eyes light up. Yeah. I actually say that this mortar and pestle is like a, a party in a box. Yeah. When it comes to your house, immediately you will start to think about how you're going to set this out on your table with some chips around it. You're maybe going to have some salsa in it, mm -hmm. or maybe you're going to have some guacamole, which is what we're going to go to oh next because goodness. this is literally one of my absolute favorite things to do for guests when they come over. I make a really simple guacamole, and that's okay. what we have here. Okay. And it's, it's just flavored with cilantro, a little bit of green chili, and some onion. That's all. That's easy. And then I put all of these different toppings around here so that each of my guests has the opportunity to customize their guacamole. So I'm going to let you customize oh. a guacamole for yourself. Okay. I think okay. I may indulge in the same thing. Um, <laughs> okay. Let me grab a spoon here, and you can go into this beautiful guacamole. Oh. But what you have here is a little bit of crumbled fresh cheese. That's the Mexican queso for Okay. You could maybe put goat cheese, some toasted mm -hmm. pumpkin seeds, mm -hmm. some tomato, which a lot of people like in their guacamole, yeah. and then we've got pomegranate seeds. Who thinks about pomegranate seeds on guacamole? But it's absolutely delicious. Wow. Crumbled bacon. I always say crumbled bacon should be for everybody's use. <laughs> no. You can put it on anything. I would put it on my cereal in the morning <laughs> if I had the opportunity. <laughs> and then a little bit of roasted peppers. That's the, the roasted poblano pepper. So what are you going to choose to... Cheese. Okay, I like that. That. That's a really a little, good thing. Oh, 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 I just made a mess, but I'm, uh, I'm going to do a right. little bit of, I like the, the yeah, uh, pumpkin, pumpkin seeds. Because they add a really toasty that. note to it, a really delicious note that, uh, to me, has um, a little bit of crunch and flavor that I particularly like. Look, Look how beautiful that is. I think it's gorgeous. Yeah, that's a gorgeous guacamole and there. You, right. You know what? It's something like this that's so simple, but it really does make it festive. It, it really does. does make a party. Absolutely. And it doesn't have to take much, and that's the thing. When it comes to entertaining, whether it's your, you know, your family or your friends, or maybe it's just, you know, you and and the household on a, a Thursday evening when you're watching TV, yeah. it doesn't have to take a lot. Make it special, and when it's made, when it starts handmade, mm -hmm. and then you can finish it handmade. Instead of always buying something in a container and opening up a plastic lid, it makes all the difference. You are going to be the toast of your neighborhood mm -hmm. with a, a beautiful handcrafted molca from Mexico. Put all these beautiful toppings out. Let everybody customize their guacamole to suit their own taste. That's really exactly what you're looking for here. Oh my gosh. That's so, so good. It's good, isn't good. it? Good. Okay. Yes. Now, you're also going to want to put this mortar out on your counter because it, in and of itself, is just beautiful to look at. And the reason you're going to want it on the countertop is because it is super useful as a way to crush spices. Now, yeah. probably you think of a mortar and pestle mostly as a way to crush spices. Okay. I think of it as a way to make salsa and a way to make guacamole yeah. because to me, that's where my mind always goes when I'm in the kitchen. But just look at this. We've got a dry mortar here and I'm gonna put some uh, peppercorns in here, whole peppercorns, um, and then I'm gonna crush them and it takes me literally about 10 seconds to get beautifully cracked pepper. Oh wow. Now, that in and of itself is pretty remarkable because mm -hmm. you, all you can think about is when you grab your pepper grinder mm -hmm. and how long it would take to make a whole teaspoon or more yeah. of the of fresh ground pepper, yeah. but smell it. I know, it just brings out the flavor. Oh my gosh, <laughs> that is the real oh, wow. flavor of pepper. Yeah. And if you're one of those people that uses a lot of pre-ground pepper, yeah. oh my gosh, this you're piece right. of equipment is going to revolutionize your life. You're missing yeah. out, that's <laughs> true, Literally, that's true. Literally, this is the real flavor of pepper. And in fact, any dry spice mm -hmm. that you want to crush right before you use it yeah. is what's gonna give you all the flavor in your dish. And the thing is this, when it comes to what makes food good, when it comes to when you're cooking for your family, 
These are the extras that yep. really make all the difference. Absolutely. It's the way you season your food. It's the it's the extras that you put into it. Right. And that's what we're talking about right here with the mortar and pestle. Just so you know, fewer than 400 of these are available. That's it because these have to be and they're, they are authentically handmade, hand carved um, by artisans in Mexico and you get them and these are a great size. And, and just in case you were wondering, the way that you clean them, you can wash them out, absolutely. dry them thoroughly, and that's it. You don't, that's there's it. not a lot of, of babysitting when it comes to this. No, I, I own three or four or maybe 10 of these because <laughs> I love them and I collect them all the time. And I literally just put them under cold running water and I use a brush and just brush them out and they're great. This is so great. Okay, yeah, so I'm okay. glad you have a chance to get them. I know that we do have to move on, but stay on the phone. These are brand new. These are 530-028. That's the number to get them home. Fewer than 400 of them uh, are left and I do see a lot of you on the phone calling in to pick these up so definitely stay there for that. Okay. All right. We're moving oh, so. on now to making tortillas. We are and I wanted okay. to share with you because a lot of you are shopping with us on hsn.com as well that's a smart way to go. Couple clicks and you get whatever you want. Um, if grilling is what you want we do have our charbroil big easy three-in-one roaster smoker and grill. We've got that. Summer's coming up and a lot of times people think summer grill oh, it goes hand in hand. I think it does. I think so. So so um, you can check that out on hsn.com hsn.com that's a big customer pick as well okay. okay now we're on to absolutely making the best tacos of your life and yeah. it starts with the best tortillas okay so i have de designed an incredible tortilla press mm. now a lot this is not for making flour tortillas. This is we're making corn tortillas, the mm -hmm. traditional tortilla of Mexico. Okay. And you buy the package of the masa harina. You can buy it in any grocery store. You add warm water to it, and this is what it looks like. Okay. So you will, after you get it to the consistency, I say, of like sticky Play-Doh, that's yeah. kind of what I'm looking for there. Yeah. I want it to be almost sticky enough that it sticks to your fingers, but not quite there. Then I press it out. I'll show you that in a second here. But I press that out, and then I, I un mold it from plastic that I've pressed it out from, and I'm gonna put it onto a, a, a heated griddle. Now this griddle doesn't have any oil on it or anything. You're just baking it on an ungreased griddle. Okay. And let me let me go back to this, showing this while that one's cooking the first time. Okay. But this is just to make a, a walnut size all right, Ball. you just rolled it up. Put yeah. it down on a piece of plastic, mm -hmm. press it down like that, and then this is made from cast iron, which gives it great weight and makes, and it pretty much does all of the work for you. Just a gentle press, flip it around, press it again. Mm -hmm. I like to do that a couple of times like that. Pull off the top piece of plastic and then just unmold it onto my hand. Now, this will give us the basic oh, wow. tortilla that then I put right in there. I'll look at this one over here. Oh, wow. When I look at these and I think these are all handmade. Yeah, these are super Taco cool. Tuesday will never be the same. No, it won't actually. <laughs> it won't because when you, if you, you want to have great tasting tacos, you have to start off with great tortillas. You and, do. And, and we were talking, getting them, you know, in, in a, you know, in a plastic bag at the grocery store. We can do better, and right. we can do better when it's easy, and that's what we're talking about here. Um, and remember, this is for corn tortillas. They make about, what, seven, seven and a quarter inches in diameter. Right. So that perfect size. Absolutely. Oh, wow. And I've got some that are already made here. I want you to taste this mm, because when to. you taste this tortilla, this is one of the handmade tortillas, it will it will really mm. kind of change your opinion about corn tortillas. I could just eat this. It's so good, isn't it? <laughs> I know. Absolutely. <laughs> Absolutely. So good. And fr wow, that yep. was no time. No, no, it takes about a minute and a half per each one of them. Wow. Yeah. Okay, so you see. I'm sorry, now I'm talking with my mouth full. You Which see Which is just how easy fine because it makes me happy that you're sure talking with your yeah. mouth full. <laughs> and do you know how special that's going to be? Yeah when your family sees that you made, what, what you made, that could be kind of, you know, the basic Taco Tuesday, but you made this from scratch. It didn't take you any time right. to do it. Absolutely. You've got the weight of this cast iron, and that does all of the work. It because, does. Because some and people think making tortillas is, a, is very labor intensive. Right. It's, a, it's a, a simple process, and when you get used to the, the habit of just rolling that ball out mm -hmm. and pressing it between two plates like this, mm -hmm. flipping it around, giving it a little press, flattening it completely evenly all the way around, and then unmolding it onto your griddle. 
<laughs> and of course, there's since there's no oil in yeah. this, uh, these are going to be just corn. There's okay. nothing else in here. Oh, just wow. corn. It couldn't be. It couldn't be fresher. Yes. Now, now your now your tortilla press is already, it's pre-seasoned, so it's already ready to use. It's, it's cast ready to iron. Use, absolutely. It, yeah, so there's nothing It's got a nice coating on the outside of it. It'll be yours forever. Yes, definitely. And so you're gonna be able to make your tortillas. You can make um, what you need for empanadas and, and yes, exactly. mini pizza crusts. You know, you could even use it if you ever do any like cookies um, that you press out. It's a perfect way to use, to press out those that oh, cookie dough. Great idea. Yeah. Okay, so you see that there are so many different uses. That I'm so glad to see so many of you are loving this. You're probably thinking, this is exactly what I've been looking for and you can't typically find it but chef Rick Bayless again he's been <laughs> in the industry for years he makes authentic he's really specialized in authentic Mexican cuisine has brought to us the best of the best take advantage of the cooks event price the free shipping the flex pay and I'm gonna finish my tortilla okay. no 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 so I'm gonna good. give you I'm gonna give you uh, uh, one that just came off the griddle now this is a little bit hot so watch okay. it when you eat it but mm. I have to say just mm. the smell mm. of it is mm. so beautiful sort of toasty it smells oh a little bit like popcorn. It's so delicious. Oh, this and is this is the piece of equipment that allows you to do the only way that you can make corn tortillas. This is so good. I love to hear your passion, and I love that you bring it to us, Chef. My Thank pleasure. Thank you so much. Um, if you if you want the, the stock pan, again, very, very limited. We're going to give you last call on that one very soon. Go ahead and pick that up. We are going to see you again uh, coming up at 10 a.m., right? Mm -hmm. Absolutely. Right. I'll be back at 10 a.m. See you at 10. I'm going to eat my tortilla. Mm -hmm. Stay on the line for yours. We've got more of our Cooks event coming Absolutely. Up. Thanks, folks. <laughs> HSN is your go-to place to shop and hsn.com is the place to start. Miss something that already aired? No problem. It's right here. Looking for great deals? Look no further. Get our daily 10 faves. A quick scroll gives you our picks for the day. Want to watch anywhere? HSN streams live 24-7 on your laptop, tablet or phone. Watch us anytime, anywhere. What are you waiting for? Join us at hsn.com right now. Lancôme Paris tomorrow on HSN from Italy a land known for luxury heritage and style comes Perlier exquisitely crafted natural ingredients where tradition meets modern science the ultimate spa experience no appointment necessary Shop Perlier, Wednesday. HSN, and this is our 24-hour Spring Cooks event, which means you are seeing the best of the best that we have literally scoured the world over to bring to you. And this is something that I'm excited to talk about for, for the rest of this hour because what you're seeing here is a huge customer pick on hsn.com. And I know you're thinking, well, it's, you know, it's an oven, you know, it, it's a, you know, a countertop oven. No, no, no. This is from Panasonic. It's a countertop induction oven, which is very, very different from any that you've ever seen. I'll tell you, we've had this on air. We had it on air one day. It became a complete success. We are able to bring it back in for you. But what you're looking at here is induction cooking and infrared cooking. So if you wanna cook faster, if you want your food to be more flavorful, to be moist, not be dried out, not be you know iffy, you, don't, you never know, are you cooking on the right temperature? Is it going to work this time? It would taste it better last time I cooked. No, when you use induction cooking, that is what you get. You get the best cook every single time. Time. And that's why when you go into restaurants and professional restaurants, you're going to see that they're using infrared cooking and 
it's paired right here with induction cooking. And this is all from Panasonic. And yes, it is that Panasonic. The, it, the world famous, uh, technolo technological company that you have that we've all grown up with we're very happy to be able to bring to you this oven and I'll tell you our cooks event price is phenomenal because if you look around and I do kind of give you a slight little challenge to look around if you find this oven anywhere else it's going to be six hundred dollars so just today, you're getting about $130 difference, $130 that you keep in your pocket, but you get to cook faster, better, moist food, and it's going to be so easy. And we are going to give you the full demonstration. Kelly Diedring is joining us this morning uh, to give us all the details. <laughs> and I know this is one of your new favorites. I am so excited, you guys, because this is truly the future, future of food cooking. Yeah. Honest to goodness, induction technology in a sealed environment, utilizing in infrared, double infrared at the top. Okay, so when you're thinking, well, what does that do for me? It gives you crispy on the outside, tender results faster. Let me just showcase what we've done. By the way, you're getting a full color cookbook coming included as well. This is the first meal because I think a lot of people, they want to be able to do their beautiful chicken dishes, but you would always have to take this in two steps because we've done our vegetables at the same time. This is oh, a wow. full chicken dish with our vegetables. And here's the secret because it's induction technology technology in a sealed environment, you're getting all the moisture circulating around the oven. The moisture cannot escape, so it goes back into your food. But because you have those infrared beams at the top, yeah. it gives you a crisp result. Let's let that rest for just one minute. Okay. Because we're actually going to do a couple of meals start to finish. Okay. Because it's so fast. Now, think of it this way. You always put your protein in the center, all right? Because that's where most of the induction is the strongest. Then you put your vegetables around on the outside. You are now doing chicken and vegetables all in the same pan, all at the same time. This is not a two-step process. This is a big deal for those of you that are sick and tired of cleaning 20 different plates or <laughs> pots or pans or whatever it is. So you're getting this high quality die cast aluminum pan. You always use it. You just slide it right on into the oven itself. By the way, you can actually see our induction burner on the inside there. Yeah. And there's a little circle. So you just slide that right in. And then this is double wall glass, you guys. This is the highest of the high quality. There's actually a seal around the exterior so that when I close this oven, all the moisture and evaporation circulates and cannot escape the oven. Wow. That's a big deal. You've only ever heard of that type of a te te technology yeah. in a pressure cooker, yeah. but a pressure cooker can't crisp. Yeah. It can't brown. It can't give you those crispy results that you would expect. Right. Now, this is my favorite part of the oven because this is what Panasonic does so well, you guys. Okay. They're an electronics company. Yeah. So the display here, you have grill, you have broil, you have combo cooking, you can auto cook, you can set it to bake, you can you know do your own sets. But look how simple it is to use. All right, so I'm gonna choose combo. And I'm gonna, it, it'll tell me what my combos are. By the way, your book, it tells you exactly what combos are. Okay. So I'm gonna ha go ahead and select combo one, and I'm gonna hit start. It's so intuitive now, it's gonna tell me, okay, go ahead and set your time, my friend. All right, so you saw I did chicken breast and I did vegetables. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna give those- And potatoes a, in and there potatoes. too. And potatoes. I'm gonna give that about 20 minutes. We're gonna come back to this. It will beep when it's done. It will keep it warm for you yeah. as well. And nice. in 20 minutes now, yeah. I have a meal with my chicken and my vegetables vegetables all done in a single pan wow. meal. That's yes. unheard of it is. with any other oven. 20 minutes, okay, start to finish. Um, it's not going to be dried out. So can we say goodbye to the, can we say goodbye to dry chicken? You can say goodbye to your big oven, Tamara. Oh, I'm going to be that, gosh. I'm going to go that far. Look oh, wow. at the moisture coming out of that slice of chicken, you guys. Oh my can goodness. Can you see how moist that is? Now your big oven, I've come to realize, is sort of intended to dry food out, gosh darn it. <laughs> that was the it's point. just yeah. not easy to use. Yeah. Uh, you get the dry results with your big oven. With oh this oven, goodness. just going inside two slices, you guys, yeah. can you see the moisture just dripping yes. from that? Look how gorgeous that chicken is. Oh my now, goodness. my vegetables were done at the exact same time. So mm -hmm. now I have a meal mm -hmm. for four easily, yeah. all 
done with one pot all done in my Panasonic oven. So you might be thinking, <laughs> all right, well, why in the world do I need that technology? That's the type of technology that's traditionally in a five-star restaurant. The induction, you know you love induction. Listen, mm -hmm. if you are in, obsessed with induction technology and induction cooking like I am, you're already calling us, okay? You yeah. know what we're talking about. But this is combined with infrared. So you can see right here, the induction heats up from the bottom. All right, that's that, you know, instant heat. That's that exact, exact precise temperature control. Now on the top, we have those double infrared lights. You guys, that's mm -hmm. unheard of. Those are the type of lights that are in very, very expensive, you know, five-star restaurants. Yes. That infrared is actually what seals in the moisture. Yeah. But it also gives you a crispy exterior. And now what you see happening there with the arrows is that all that circulation goes back into the food. So all the natural moisture, all the natural flavors, all the natural juices, mm -hmm. now there's no escaping yes. when you're using your induction technology. That's it goes right. back into the food and itself. That is the way that this is designed. And that is why from the moment we brought this to HSN, it was a huge hit. As a matter of fact, you can read the reviews on hsn.com. Oh, people go crazy They're for this. They're reviews. They, they really are. And if you're somebody who you're doing the cooking and you're kind of struggling with trying to get the food right, trying to not dry it out, trying to keep everything timed so that your protein is done when your vegetables are done and nothing's overdone or One underdone. Pan, my Let friend. Panasonic do it. Look at this. All right. so, what are you, what are you so popping So we're in? utilizing our grill function. So when you utilize your grill function, you want to preheat it. So we had this preheated. Now you can rest this tray right here on the lid, so don't worry about that at all. I've popped in my steaks. You guys can actually hear that beautiful sizzle. Mm -hmm. I'm going to go ahead and pop them back in there. And now it's telling me, set the time, okay? This is how easy it is to use. So I'm going to give this eight minutes. I'm going to flip them in the middle, but eight minutes start to finish, you guys. I'm going to have the most decadent, beautiful, juicy, moist, and perfectly cooked steaks. Ooh. And it's hands-free. I didn't have to get out my grill. I didn't have to go out and stand and sweat. Yes! I'm going to have the most beautiful <laughs> five-star steaks done in my home with oh this oven, my God, you guys. Anytime, anytime you want steak, now you've got it, and all you had to do was walk into the kitchen. You didn't, like you said, you didn't have to fire up the grill, and no. they're going to pr be perfect every time, just as if you went to that steak restaurant and paid a lot of money for, for that same meal that you could make at home. And that's the deal, too. You're getting that restaurant, not just restaurant quality, high-end restaurant quality oh, food five-star restaurant, you guys. Before now, we didn't have infrared in our home kitchen. No. We, it's just too expensive, all right? I'm going to slice into this. Now, this is our pork roast wrapped in bacon. I mean, how beautiful is that, you guys? <laughs> oh Perfectly cooked cooked on the inside, you are now becoming a chef in your own home. Each wow. and every slice is going to be moist, juicy, and tender. Mm -hmm. Do me a favor, if you're watching us, A, look for this oven elsewhere. Yeah, it's $600 yeah. Yeah. everywhere else. We're giving you an awesome mm -hmm. deal. And I'm telling you guys, this really is the future of cooking, yeah. of food preparation. And, you know, Food preparation and cooking is all about manipulating heat, manipulating temperature the right way. Mm -hmm. That's what we do. We want to be able to cook our foods with the moist interior, but we want that crispy exterior. Up until now, we'd have to get a $300 air fryer to yeah. do the crispy, but it wouldn't right. be moist on the inside. Yeah. Or we'd have to pressure cook it, which doesn't give you the crispy, gives right. you the moist, doesn't give you the crispy. Right. The Panasonic oven does both. So you might be thinking, okay, and it's, ex and it's an expensive price tag. Right. It is worth every single penny for the beautiful beautiful, delicious yes. meals that come out of this oven. That's and great. I'm not a chef. Yeah. And that's a big thing about this. I'm a home cook. I'm mm -hmm. like you. Mm -hmm. I like to feed my family a beautiful meal, mm -hmm. but I am not a, you know, a classically trained chef. Right. You don't have to be. You don't. Panasonic makes you a chef in your own home. That's the thing. You don't have to be a chef. What I like, I always talk to Kelly. It's like, you don't have to be a chef. You just have to know what tastes good. You just have you to play one on what you like. Yeah. 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 No, you really. Know what you like. Exactly. And this is it. And this yes. is why people initially really, um, kind of flocked to this oven because they do recognize, wait a minute, I get the best of That's all worlds. I get hungry. crispy, thank you. <laughs> I get crispy, I get moist, I get juicy, I get seasoned, I get flavored, yep. and I get that result every single time without ever having to go to my oven and turning the knob and waiting for 20 minutes. Because all of that waiting for 20 minutes, that's money down the drain and on that electricity bill. And it heats up your bill. big kitchen. It does. We're frustrated with our ovens, you guys. There's a reason that, you know, 
every company is trying to outdo the big old box <laughs> oven. That's true. We, they all are. Panasonic finally did it. We did it with a sealed induction technology. This technology doesn't exist anywhere else in the world right now. Mm -hmm. If you buy this oven, you are the <laughs> only person that has this technology. Wow. I mean, that's crazy. All right, yeah. let's let's get okay. back to the food, my friends, okay. because we okay. can all love our pizzas. Yeah. So whether this is your homemade pizza, whether it's your frozen pizza, mm -hmm. I don't care what it is. This oven does the best pizzas I've ever met. Okay. And it's because you have in, you have direct heat from the bottom with the induction, and then you have direct heat from the top. So you get the crispy underneath, and you get that beautiful, uh, beautiful melty cheese. So okay. this is a very high quality, very heavy duty die cast aluminum pan. You always use the pan no matter what you're cooking. So even if you have your own bakeware, use the pan and put your bakeware on the top. Okay. I'm going to close it. Remember, this is a completely sealed environment, you guys. This is this is something we're not used to. But I just want you to maybe watch the presentation for a little while. Mm -hmm. You're going to see the results. You can't get them any other technology. Right. So when I when I close this, we have those double glass lids. We have that seal. This is cool. So I'm going to go ahead and choose auto cook. Remember, okay. you have a variety of functions. You can grill. You can broil. This one's going to tell me, all right, am I doing poultry? Am I doing fish? Am I doing fish with vegetables? Mm. I mean, I'm not kidding you. It gives you every option. Am I doing a frozen pizza? Yeah. I'm doing a frozen pizza. I'm going to go ahead and hit start. Now it's going to ask me, get this, Tamara, yeah. how large is my pizza? Ah. I love this oven. Yeah. All right, I'm going to tell it it's, a, it's obviously a full-size 12-inch pizza. Right. I'm going to go ahead and hit start. Okay. I don't know how much time it needs. Okay. I don't have to know how much time it needs. Right. Panasonic it. has it all programmed to per. Mm -hmm. So I'm doing a 12-inch pizza. I'm doing a 9-inch pizza. I select the size of my pizza. Yeah. I literally walk away. And that's it. That's it. And it's going to be have perfect. To, and, it's, and it's, I love that it's at eye level. Yeah. So a lot of people, you know, they're worried about bending yeah. over, getting yeah. large items out. You right. don't have to worry about that. It's, it's right at eye level. All right, okay. let's. Ooh, you guys, look at these I know. Uh, so, they're, right. so they're about halfway done now. Can you hear that? Yeah. That sizzle, Ooh. that beautiful grilling, that crisping, you guys. Can you hear that? Now, wait till I flip these. It's going to give you a better result than if you're even doing it on your grill. Oh, my gosh. Can look. you see? And that's only um, half done so and far. And, we're not, and we only have four minutes. That was four minutes ago that yeah. we popped those in. Yeah. Look at that. Oh, wow. You would never oh be goodness. able to do that in any other, you know, you certainly would never do that in your oven. But a lot of times, people don't want to go outdoors. It's too hot. Yeah. It's too cold. Yeah. It's raining. Whatever is the that's reason. Right. You are going to get oh the most gosh. beautiful five star restaurant result with your steaks that you've ever Unbelievable. experienced. Unbelievable. Isn't that gorgeous? I told you during our cooks event, I told you at the beginning of the show that th these are the kind of events that we really do look far and wide to really try to bring you the best of the best. Yeah, that's true. And not just the best of the best, the kinds of things that make our cooking life and our home life that much easier and um, that much warm for ourselves and for our family and friends. And from Panasonic, that's what this is. And it really has been from the very beginning uh, and I'll tell you when it comes to your old or I shouldn't call it your old oven but maybe I should because it is. it's your old oven technology. Is as old, and it's as old as your house in, in a lot true. of cases it's so true. and it probably doesn't heat as evenly as it used to but look at what this does so you can actually see and I love this be or this animation because it shows you the induction technology that's the instant precise heat coming from the bottom if you know and love induction you have got to have this now you also have double infrared lights coming from the top that I've never seen double infrared, okay? So not only that, but we're combining it with that perfect seal. So that's what you saw, that little red outline was the seal on this oven. It creates an airtight environment. So all the moisture, all the juices, all the natural evaporation that's happening doesn't actually leave your food. Mm -hmm. It goes back into your food. If you own a pressure cooker, you've heard me say that with pressure cooking. Yeah. The one thing I will never say with a pressure cooker is that it will crisp up your food. It just doesn't. Yeah. If you love a crispy chicken breast, if you love that beautiful caramelization on your steaks, if you want that browning in your vegetables that you could never get with any other way of doing it, yeah. unless you're standing over a fry pan, mm -hmm. you have got to try this oven. I know it yeah. sounds like we're crazy excited about it. Right. It is the future of food cooking. It, it is. just is. And let me tell you, you could find this in, you know, some other places. You'd have to look at more specialized places, big box places. And you're spending $600 for it. You just are. Yeah, it and is. you can look around, you can look online. You're spending $600 for it. Even our regular price will be that at some point, but right now that we have it as a Cook's event price, uh, $130 less than everywhere else. Go. For, why would you not? And when you have your entire 
when you have your entire um, meal that you can cook all at the same time, we're talking. Look at uh, the. So we did our pork chops. Our pork chops. Now, yeah. by the way, if you're just joining us, you're in for a treat. Okay, okay. you gotta watch the presentation because the food that comes out of this oven. Yeah. We did our Brussels, Brussels sprouts, I love Brussels sprouts, and then we've used. You can see oh this is our cast aluminum pan. This could be any bakeware or anything that would go in your big oven. You can pop inside this oven, so you don't have to worry. There's no special rules here. Okay. Okay. You just always want to use the induction pan on the bottom, but anything can go on the top. Okay. Now we did our pork chops, and I'm gonna slice into one, I'm gonna create a dinner plate, and we did our Brussels sprouts and we did our mac and cheese, and you might be thinking, well you did them all separately. Mm -hmm. Every single thing was cooked at the exact same time. Oh my gosh. It's because you put your proteins in the center where the induction heat is the strongest, and then your vegetables and your sides, all that heat radiates out. But remember, you're also getting heat from the top, those infrared bulbs give you that crisp, oh, that, that caramelization yeah. on the top that you wouldn't even get in your traditional oven unless you took a to, second step to broil. Right, yep. and then I can't tell you how many times I <laughs> I turned it on broil and then I walked away for like 30 seconds and too it's long burnt. and everything is yep. burnt. And look at our pork chop. So not only is that cooked to perfection, you can yeah. see it's not dried out. Yeah. It's tender. It's juicy. It's moist. It Everybody good. gets a decadent meal. Everybody yeah. is going to look at you and say, when did you take cooking classes? Yeah. Did you go to chef school when, you know, maybe you haven't seen somebody in a while. Yeah. Honest to goodness, you guys, this, this makes you a chef in your own home. Maybe you're a good cook. Maybe you're not such a great cook. Mm -hmm. It doesn't matter with this oven. It, it helps just you. doesn't matter. It helps you because yep. it's hard to do it wrong because, you know, and you'll notice Kelly's going to do show us again the way you can dial in exactly what you're cooking yep. um, so that it knows the Look precise that time that it has to be and you don't have to guess. We've all played that guessing game way too long on is this the right temperature? Is this the right time? Well, in your big oven out? you don't know if it's the right temperature because it has such a wide range. So yes, if your big old right. oven heats up and you set it to 350, honestly get a it, thermometer. Yeah. Tell me if it's really 350. Yeah. It's not. There's such a range. It might be 320 inside there. You don't know. Yeah. You know, our big old ovens are designed to sort of dry our foods out. It's true. They take up a lot of space. I joked, but I'm half serious. I told mm -hmm. my husband, my next house, I'm not putting an oven in it. I've got, <laughs> I, you don't need it. Not when you, you have honestly, the Panasonic. you don't and need just it. just so you know, this sits on your countertop. Mm -hmm. I mean, it takes up about as much space as, as a traditional kind of countertop oven. Sure. So really not a lot when you consider that. And the fact that it cooks faster, it cooks easier. You're not firing up the big oven. You're not heating up all of that space, even just to cook a smaller meal. So this is not, you don't have to be feeding an army of people. It's going to be great for if it's just you or just you and your partner, maybe you and a couple kids, or if you do want to, or those, you know, days where you just kind of want to go all out and make something that looks extra special, but you didn't spend any extra time doing it. I mean, oh, listen, are the steaks done? you can cook from frozen in here. Oh if God, you'd like to do to chicken believe. breast from frozen, you can do that. Look at these steaks. Maybe you're just joining us. You're flipping through the channels. You didn't see me load these. Eight minutes ago, these were raw. Yeah. How gorgeous <laughs> are those steaks, that? Tamara? I mean, good. look at the front, look at the back. You have the perfect grill marks. Yeah. You have the moisture. Think about Five Star Restaurant. Yeah. You might think they're grilling your steaks. Mm -hmm. They're using an infrared oven that costs tens of thousands of dollars many times. Yeah. You're now getting infrared in your home, in your kitchen, you guys. Before now, before Panasonic, this technology didn't exist for the consumer home. That's you right. You had to own a restaurant that's right. to have those types of results. And now Look you at have... how perfectly cooked. Oh, that is, that's, I oh mean, my gosh, that's are everything. are you kidding me? That's life. That, when you that think is, about that it. That is so everything. That's why I say you would spend a lot of money going to a restaurant to have this exact steak yep. once. Yeah. Right? I mean, and then everything else is a la carte and everything a lot of times comes out separately because they're also cooking it separately yep. in many cases. This is something that you can all do, you can do all at one time yep. in your kitchen. In your kitchen. And, and it doesn't matter how old your old oven is, your brand new Panasonic has the latest and greatest technology and you get a chance to be some of the first who can get it. Because like I said, it's been on air one day before. It Everybody loved it. Oh, it would be, read and the read reviews. the reviews. I it's mean, they so are true. phenomenal. Look at that steak, you guys. And I tell you, if you you know, because usually it's it's us, it's the women yep. who have to cook for the family every sure. single day. Oftentimes it is. And yes, ma'am. You're trying to find a way. Okay, how can I cook chicken where it's not dry this time? How can I cook, cook, cook something for the family where they're not complaining? Oh, mom, this isn't all that great. 
you know what? Make it easier yeah. on yourself. Let Panasonic do all the work. If you want to have steak for dinner, have steak for dinner yeah. without firing up the grill. And you don't have to, not only do you not have to fire up the grill, you don't have to do anything except load your oven. The induction technology combined with the infrared does all the work. It creates a moist result on the inside and that crispy result on the outside. Now, my friends, if you are somebody that loves your brownies, your cupcakes, your cakes, mm. uh, we had a little theme going for this evening and I know uh, our theme was, you know, Mexico, which I absolutely love Mexican food. Know, me so we too. did some beautiful Mexican brownies. Oh, wow. Uh, I'm going to slice into them. And we did a meringue on top. By the way, wow. you can broil can I, in here. Can I? Yes, ma'am. Oh, it's a perfect meringue. It's a perfect oh, meringue. And we browned it inside this oven. You don't have to have anything, you know, any specialty. Uh, you know, I've seen them use the little heat guns and yeah. all that. You can do it inside your oven. Oh, my but gosh. You, when you bake in here, you guys, and by the way, you can see that I'm <gasps> using my own bakeware. Yeah. Look at that brownie Kelly. with that meringue on the top. Oh my goodness. All right, and goodness. this is a cliche, but does my pregnant friend want some chocolate? Oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> I almost it, said something else. Uh, yeah. Sorry, I didn't mean to, but you know, she's a woman and she wants chocolate and she's pregnant. So what a silly oh question. Gosh, but no. honest to goodness, you guys, mm -hmm. you're gonna, your baking is gonna be not only faster, okay, it's probably gonna be 30 to 40% faster, but it's gonna be moister because that circular Mm. on the mm. inside of the oven allows a moist, juicy oh result. It's so so that good. when, you know, like in your big old oven, when, when you have evaporation, that steam's leaving your oven. That's why your house gets so hot. Yeah. That's why you're turning down the air conditioner every time you turn on your oven. This circulates on the inside of the oven and the circulation, that moisture goes back into your food. I'm sorry. I have to laugh at her face. Baby likes the brownies. The baby does. And you know what? You know brownies, if you make them at home, they're dry. Yeah, they I mean, always I've are. I've never made a non-dry brownie. I don't even know how, I didn't know how it was done. And <laughs> now I understand it was my oven. It wasn't me, it wasn't my, my recipe. It was my oven yep. because it may have been overcooking them. It may have been cooking at too high a temperature or too low. They were tasting, taking, you know, taking too long. This is the way this works. It is cooking with induction from the bottom. Yes, ma'am. From infrared from the top. None of that moisture is escaping. You've got exactly the texture that you want because that's one of the things. Now, like we were saying, I love pressure cooking. I love slow cooking. Mm -hmm. But what you don't get is, that crisp. is the crispy. You don't get the texture. Um, I made some uh, Cornish hens the other day in the slow cooker, and hubby said, they taste good, but the texture's not there. That's because you don't have the right tools. They were too mushy. Yeah. It's so true. And you know, you might be thinking, okay, well, maybe I wasn't watching tonight and thinking I needed a new countertop oven. That's probably more likely mm. than not the truth of what's happening in your home. But when you hear about these technologies, there's no other oven in the world that gives you induction technology in a sealed environment. So that as the moisture evaporates out of your food, your natural moisture, your natural flavors, it goes back into your food food, not only by the circulation, but by the double infrared that's at the top. So you're getting induction, you're getting infrared, and you're getting it in a sealed environment. That's where the technology comes to play. That's why, you know, it's one of those items. You get what you pay for, yeah. honestly. You get what you, you will be blown away by the results. Read our reviews. Yes. Um, it, it, in, uh, you know, a little another nod to our beautiful uh, Mexican theme today. We oh, did our enchiladas, back. beef enchiladas on the inside here, you know, at the end, top it with, you know, your fresh vegetables or whatever. Whatever it is, yeah. but you're getting a beautiful result. You're getting the moisture, but you're getting the cheese melted oh, wow. to perfection. So perfect. You're getting them cooked all the way through, you guys, and you're getting it with a faster result. And also notice again, look at that. Kelly used the the, the pan yes, that comes with along my own with it. Twelve inch casserole with dish. Yes. Yeah, so yep. there's so there's nothing special. You don't have to relearn how to cook, and no. I think that's the thing. Sure. Sometimes when we want to kind of step out and try something a little bit different, because we know it's better we know it's faster and we know it's going to give us a better result but you might be thinking i don't want to have to relearn how to cook everything i already know how to cook you don't have to make it and prepare it the same way you would just do it easier yes. with Panasonic. And that was the entire idea. Their idea was not to make something more complicated because who needs more complication in life? Yes, exactly. You know? Could you make things more difficult could you for make, me? Could you make it a no. little harder to get food on the table for my family? No, yeah, no, no. All right, my friends, you're getting, by the way, the Culinary Institute of America. That is the finest of the fine in terms of, you know, teaching mm -hmm. schools and culinary yeah. schools. 
they have partnered with Panasonic and they have said this induction oven is so cool. It's so futuristic. Yeah. It's so future proof that we want to partner with you on a cookbook. They love this oven so much that this book comes included. It's your guide. Keep it on hand for your guide, but it also has 26 full color recipes. Oh, this, this is one of them. This is great. Yes. Yeah, so this is this. our beautiful salmon dish. And all we've did was treat it with a little bit of rosemary and some lemon. And can you even see oh our lemon goodness. is grilled to perfection? Oh, wow. My friends. I mean, that is the result that you get with this oven and you get it every time. This? And that's what I was saying. You become now a chef in your own home. This is fantastic. Isn't that great? Oh my gosh. Oh, oh, this is it. The baked lim. Oh no, this is the baked lemon and stuffed trout. But you can see there's so much, whether it's lamb or maybe it's steak or fish of any kind. Just, you you've got vegetables. This. You've got it all right here. And it does come along with your Panasonic uh, countertop induction oven as well. So, so look at the skin on the salmon. Oh, it is wow. cooked so perfectly. Have you ever done this and the skin just sticks to it or yes. it's too burnt? Yeah. The skin will literally just peel back oh, off of your my fish. God. And look at how that's working. And then I'm going to take my forks because I don't want to slice into it because I don't want to ruin it. It's so okay. beautiful. Okay. But I'm going to take my forks, you guys, mm -hmm. and just do some, you know, just sort of fork it apart. Okay. Every single so bite, flaky. and it's stuffed, it's yeah. so flaky. It's so cooked to perfection. It's moist. It's not overdone, but it's not underdone. That's right. And, and you yeah. can really mess up seafood. You yes, can mess you can. up salmon. You, look at Especially that. salmon. You, you do, you know, you how do it 20 seconds too long that? and it's dry. It's absolutely right. But but not with Panasonic because, again, everything is already built in in terms of the temperature, the time, everything that you need. So you don't have to bring a whole lot of, well, I've got to be a chef. You don't have to bring a lot of that to nope. the kitchen. Just know what you want to eat and let Panasonic do the rest. And while you are ordering, while you're listening and shopping, we're going to go back to the, we're going to go to the phones because Deborah is calling us from, is it Louisiana? Yes, it is. Deborah, so great to talk with you. Now, are you ordering this Panasonic right now or do you already have it? I'm watering it now, but I have a friend who has one, and she, it, it's great. I've been there with her. Yeah. We've done pizza. We've yeah. done burgers. They, like, charbroil the burgers. I have stomach problems, so it yeah. does great on charbroil and burgers. Oh, wow. Um, the, it, it's just delicious. The desserts it makes, all of it. And, you know, it also has the six preset uh, menu thing. Yes. So you don't have to, you know, do any guesswork because it takes it out for you. Deborah, you know, I'm so glad that you called in, too, because that's the thing. You you have firsthand knowledge of it from a, from a friend, and now you're probably thinking, and, you know, you were probably thinking, yeah, I've got to get one of yes, my own. Yes, and so. I did get it. Mine's a better price because she paid six twenty nine for her. <gasps> yes, ma'am. I'm telling you, it's $600 <laughs> everywhere else. I know. And I get mine on FlexPay. She didn't. <laughs> yeah, oh, good for you. I love it. I love it. Listen, once you get it, call us back and I tell know. us how it works. For sure. You're going to absolutely it love it. It works fantastic, Aww. and everyone should get it. One and I have a stove with a grill in the middle. I don't even use it. Don't need to because this is going to take. You know, oh, what a great call. That. You so are. I just take that uh, a stove out. You are exactly. You know what <laughs> you're. Exactly Use that space said. for something else. Deborah, thank you so, so much for thank calling. And I'm so glad much. that we did and have I appreciate y'all, and you're great. Thank Aww, you, Deborah. Thank you, you take Deborah. care. And Deborah's right. right. Bye -bye. Goodbye. She's right. She got it on FlexPay. Yeah. You can't, not only can you not get this price anywhere, you can't get FlexPay anywhere. Tamara. So look at the, oh, oh, that was the uh, chicken. If, can you uh, maybe scoot that pizza over okay, for me? For oh, sure. no, I can, I can put it here. It's okay. Hot. All right, you guys. This was live, yeah. start to finish 20 minutes ago. With oh, our wow. vegetables, can you see? how perfectly cooked our vegetables are. Yeah. You can actually, can you hear the crispy? Can you hear the crispy skin yeah. on the chicken? Let's see if I can even find a knife for myself. Okay. But look at the, how perfectly cooked it is. Not dry. On the interior, it's moist, it's juicy, it's tender, it's gorgeous. But it was one pan. All my vegetables even have the beautiful caramelization. Because mm. of the induction, you always put your protein in the center and your vegetables on the outside. Now, potatoes no, are perfect. The potatoes are beyond perfect. <laughs> yeah. No need to take notes, you guys. The book has all the instructions. As our caller mentioned, yeah. it's very easy to use. All the combo settings are in the book. For sure. 26 full color recipes. You you're going to absolutely it. be so thrilled with this purchase. I'm this so purchase glad. is going to be one of those where you're like, oh, yeah, yes. oh, finally. Really? Finally. And, and I'm exactly. so glad so many of you are calling in to get this this evening. Remember, best, best, best price that you are going to be able to find this anywhere. Everywhere else, you're going to be paying $600 plus and nowhere else can you get this price and flex pay yes, so enjoy this one it's 533-784 that pizza smells 
Amazing. Okay. What does the pregnant woman want? We'll save it. I know. The pizza? Um, <laughs> you get pizza whatever. and enchiladas. You get your first pick. All right. <laughs> Thank, Thank you so much. Thank you. Thanks, Kelly. All right, Kelly's going to be with us throughout the day. We've got so much more of our Spring Cooks event coming up. Stay with us. <laughs> HSN Cares and Habitat for Humanity have partnered since 2011 to empower women and help families in need. Join us Friday at 9 a.m. for a special edition of At Home. For every At Home item sold, HSN Cares will donate 20% of the purchase price to Habitat. It's the perfect time to update your home and help unlock brighter futures for families across America. Search HSN Cares at hsn.com for more. There's so many things to love about HSN, but one thing that makes shopping here fun is FlexPay. Get it home now without the stress of paying all at once. Why pay full purchase price today when you can pay over time? Buy what you want now. Pay it off later with your credit or debit card. FlexPay. It's that easy. Exclusively at HSN. I'm Joy. I'm a mother. That's first and foremost. I'm curious, always curious. I'm a bit of a perfectionist and I'm an inventor. So when I'm designing product, it's all about making everyday life simpler. I guess that's just how I look at things. I find a lot of inspiration from just living my everyday life. And I think, boy, every day's a gift. Make joyful discoveries every day 